let's uncover some of the juiciest details they've been hiding. Before we jump into it, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for your wrestling videos. Sneaky Comebacks In WWE, surprise comebacks are meticulously concealed. Wrestlers making a return are often kept hidden in trailers or production trucks until their big reveal. This clandestine approach builds anticipation among fans, creating an air of excitement and unpredictability before the wrestler's triumphant return to the ring. Planned Ring Collapses In WWE, ring collapses are meticulously pre-planned for specific moments in matches. Wrestlers target designated spots to orchestrate a safe collapse, ensuring the safety of everyone involved. It's a carefully coordinated stunt that adds drama and spectacle without risking any harm to the performers. Commentators' Guided Narratives Commentators in WWE frequently receive live cues and directions from production staff, particularly during the reign of Vince McMahon. These cues guide the narrative of the matches, ensuring that the commentary aligns with the desired storyline and enhances the overall storytelling aspect of the event. This orchestrated approach aids in shaping the viewer's perception and engagement with the ongoing matches. Covert Communication in the Ring The mystery of how wrestlers recall their moves during matches isn't so mysterious after all. Wrestlers have a knack for discreetly communicating with each other in the ring often guided by seasoned veterans like John Cena, renowned for his spot-calling prowess. Through subtle cues and signals, they navigate the match, ensuring seamless execution of moves and sequences. Ringside Doctor and Safety Measures In WWE, safety is a top priority. In a match between Sheamus and Umberto Carrillo, when Umberto suffered a legitimate injury, Sheamus alerted the ringside doctor. As a result, the match was called off for safety reasons. This incident highlights WWE's unwavering dedication to the well-being and safety of its performers, showcasing their commitment to prioritizing the health of wrestlers above all else. Crash Pads in WWE In 2021, WWE safety measures came into focus. Observers noticed the presence of crash pads during Hell in a Cell matches. Even dramatic falls like McIntyre's were onto padded surfaces. This discovery sparked heated debates among fans regarding the incorporation of safety equipment in these high-intensity matches. The use of crash pads raised questions about the balance between performer safety and maintaining the authenticity and risk associated with these extreme bouts. Ever wondered how wrestlers magically appear from under the ring? They've got monitors and headsets down there to coordinate surprise entries or returns. Wrestlers lurking under the ring have more than just darkness to keep them company. A small but crucial addition is the presence of monitors. These screens allow them to stay updated with the ongoing match and the precise moment for their grand reveal. It's like having a backstage pass to the show but under the canvas. They get real-time instructions, ensuring their timing aligns perfectly with the storyline. Wrestlers strategize and coordinate their actions to create that wow factor for the audience. It's all about the element of surprise, and this underground setup is the epicenter of those theatrical moments. Vince McMahon's Limo Explosion That infamous explosion in 2007? pre-recorded and safely executed without anyone near the blasting limo. Carefully set up in advance, it ensured safety by keeping everyone away from the exploding limo. The goal was to surprise fans and make headlines, adding drama to McMahon's character and sparking widespread speculation. Choreographed like a movie scene, it left fans hanging, eagerly anticipating the next twist in the WWE story, showcasing how WWE crafts thrilling moments with careful planning and without putting anyone at risk. The Rope's Unexpected Snap At Extreme Rules, Finn Balor faced an unexpected turn when the ring ropes snapped. This surprising mishap was actually a cleverly orchestrated trick by a crew member who cut the rope, adding a dramatic twist to the match. The unforeseen incident added an element of suspense and unpredictability, creating a memorable moment in the bout. Inflated Attendance Numbers WWE's habit of touting sold-out events isn't always reflective of reality. Notably, WrestleMania 3 and WrestleMania 32 were marred by inflated attendance numbers. These exaggerated figures were strategically employed to create an illusion of overwhelming popularity portraying the events as more packed than they truly were. This practice of inflating numbers aimed to enhance the perceived success of these spectacles, rather than accurately reflecting the actual attendance.
manipulated crowd noise. For close to three decades, WWE relied on manufactured crowd noise, particularly evident during taped SmackDown episodes. This practice, criticized for diluting the authenticity of the show, involved artificially enhancing reactions to heighten the viewing experience. By using fake crowd noise, WWE attempted to manipulate the audience's perception, creating a more dynamic atmosphere on screen. Concealing Empty Arenas Both WWE and AEW presently employ a tactic of filming only one side of arenas while veiling empty sections with black curtains. This strategic move aims to create an illusion of a fully packed house when viewed on television. By selectively shooting specific angles, these promotions ensure that the audience watching at home perceives a vibrant and bustling arena, despite sections being devoid of spectators. This practice serves to maintain an appearance of high attendance, enhancing the visual appeal of the broadcasted events. Referees' Essential Role Referees aren't just there to count pins. Their role extends far beyond. They serve as pivotal figures in ensuring the seamless execution of planned spots and contributing to both the flow and safety of the match. Their keen involvement goes beyond the basics. Post a significant spot, referees discreetly check on wrestlers' well-being using a simple hand squeeze. This seemingly small yet effective gesture plays a crucial role in guaranteeing the safety of the performers. It's a silent signal that ensures wrestlers are okay, allowing the match to progress while prioritizing their safety without disrupting the action. The Truth About Kendo Sticks Wrestlers use kendo sticks in hardcore matches, but they're not as real as they seem. These props look like the actual sticks, but they're made safer with hollow wood tape. Even so, if they break, they can still cause harm. Wrestlers handle them carefully in these intense matches, balancing the excitement while making sure everyone stays safe. Thanks for joining us on this WWE Secrets Adventure. We've uncovered some fascinating hidden gems behind the scenes. Remember, the excitement doesn't stop here. WWE's world is full of surprises waiting to be discovered.